Hello, my friends, and welcome back to our continued Let's Play of the Casting of Frank Stone in the world of Dead by Daylight. My name is Afatis Bird, this is your story-based gaming channel, and today, on the recommendations of the wonderful, amazing friend of our channel, Jonathan Jimbo, he outlined a couple things that we can do differently here in the final chapter. Also, outlined a couple things that we can do if we want to do more additional playthroughs, which, well, you know, I'm, I'm okay with that. Uh... I would also like to try to see if we can do things a little bit differently as much as we humanly possibly can. Uh, but his recommendations are as follows. We're going to replay the final chapter, but let's stay and die. Succeed in the generator and then go for the elevator. His notes stop here. So I guess we just let people die at that point. I'm kind of unsure. Uh, replay the final chapter again. Let Maddie and Linda get swallowed, then file the generator and fill the QTEs. Replay the final chapter again, let Stan get sacrificed, don't go for the elevator, accept deal as end up past chase completely, try to help and fail QTEs. These are really vague things that I have no idea what these mean until we actually see them. So I think today's episode is just going to be these three things. And uh, yeah, close out our ruthless run. Well, I may not close out with this one. We may want to do a couple other things before we start Redemption Run, but either way. Let's dive into Curtain Call, the Massacre at Garrett Manor. I hope you're all having a wonderful, fantastic, amazing, awesome day today. I think what I may do is, the for the first part of this video, I'll leave everything in. And then for the, re, the reruns, I'll probably cut those. I don't mean that I'm making the video shorter than what the video would be, but I think it'd be fine. There were some patches that hit the game as well. I know I've been away for a while. I do apologize for that. Uh, why is everything so dark? Did someone not turn up the lights? Let's do this one this time. Oh yeah, obviously there's some sort of glitch here because it, it was never this dark. You got your damn movie. What more do you want? Like, look how dark everything is. I'll, let me try uh, redoing this. Also, I think I'm going to lower the difficulty. Just so we could try to succeed in all the things we want to succeed and fail in all the things we want to fail. I'll, I'll be back. Let me, let me try resetting this. Okay, I restarted, but everything is still really dark. You got dark. your damn movie. What more do you want? Maybe that's how it's supposed to be? You, you lied to me. I did no such thing. Like hell you didn't. You promised me. It is no fault of mine if you misinterpreted what I promised you. My mom just died. You knew I was grieving and you took advantage of me. A traveler is only as strong as its vessel. You got a hell of a lot to answer for, and a lot of hell to pay! It's like the final fight scene in, uh, Game of Thrones right here. Help! Help me! Help! Help me get him! <sighs> nope, we are not gonna do that. Oh, we're gonna back away. I'm sorry. It's too late. I'm so sorry. Please, I'm begging you. Please. I need to figure out what caused me to be able to use my gun. Because I want to know what happens when you use your gun and like fire at your friend. Is that? That is Frank. 
Frank. Stone. We gotta go. We gotta run. Now! Everything is so dark for some reason. Yeah, I just watched my previous video back. It is not supposed to be this dark. It's more spooky this way. But at the same time, it's not supposed to be like this. It's a whole lot more spooky this way. <laughs> Don't get me wrong. That is terrifying. Just how dark everything is and this giant demon leaping out of a movie screen. Where is it? Maybe it's knocked out from the power cut? Shit. That's how we got down here. Be another way out. Why did I think that would suddenly work? I must be losing it. Knowing my luck, I'm gonna fail the generator because it's too easy now. <laughs> oh wait, is is the difficulty still okay? No, it's not. Okay. If we can get that working, we could probably power the elevator. Let's try it. Okay, that was weird. My entire screen just like froze. Oh, I'm gonna put a uh, memo to uh, cut that out of the video because that was weird. Hey, I've been gone for a few days. I don't care about technical issues. I'm gonna enjoy this game, dang it. <laughs> Absolutely, 100%. Let's go. I was trying to go for the white and I missed. I really shouldn't go for the white. It's all the reflexes. Hey, how about that? So much easier on this difficulty. Now I have no idea what to do for the elevator. Do you think that fixed the elevator? I have no idea what to do after the elevator. Needless to say, this is gonna be a work in progress here. I love how you guys are purposely vague um, in your help because it's amazing. Because then I'm not spoiled about what's going to happen. And I can't tell you how much I appreciate that. Oh my god, it's a Kool-Aid man. Looks like Kongo in our latest Legend of Dragoon episode just busting through the wall. Go for the elevator. Oh, go for the elevator. Okay. He literally said go for the elevator. I didn't know what that meant until now. Oh my god! That kills her? Oh my god! Oh my What? That kills her? Maddie was captured? Wait, she wasn't killed? What the heck is going on? What the heck is going on? That was 
An unexpected ending. I'm like, wow, he's being really vague about what to do after you go for the elevator. And then I, I realized why it was being very vague. Interesting though, he says, let Manny or Linda get swallowed. How do I let Manny or Linda get swallowed? That's not possible. Because Stan gets swallowed. Either Stan gets swallowed or Sam gets swallowed. It's not possible for Manny or Linda to get swallowed. Not in this playthrough. Frank Stone is finally the man he was meant to be. My champion. A killer worthy of the entity. The bleed between worlds is open, split apart by sacrifice and violence. All will be swallowed by the entity's power. And what of me? The one who served up this world for it to devour. I'll oblige as its faithful servant, existing only to drink in its knowledge, share in its Glory. I am Augustine Lieber, and I have brought the entity to your world. What happens now? All these lifetimes of toil and torment, all for this beautiful moment of sublime perfection. Almost unbearably so. Why did he kill her? Oh, he's gonna put her on a hook. That's classic DVD, right? their own unique lonely way like a fingerprint but you and your mother seem to die very much the same oh wow i bear to you the offerings i humbly await my reward for loyal and you did unending yep <laughs> Manny was sacrificed outside the manse. And it was a DVD like sacrifice. Cool. I liked how that sacrifice worked. Sacrificed on a hook. I awake, unsure. 
sure where I am. Then memory floods back and I know. Our world is gone. Consumed by a living realm beyond space, beyond time. Thanks to me. And I assume all this is the same still. Whether killing or surviving, the entity will play with our souls for all eternity. An endless hunt of fear and hope, pain and sacrifice from which even death is no escape. And now, let the trial begin. I really like this game. I, I like this story. I like how it mixes DVD stuff in. I mean, it's it's it does it really well, and there's just so much diversions. Like something will happen, I'll be like, "Why did that happen? I have no idea what caused that." And I think that's wonderful. Okay, I don't think we need to see the epilogue. Pretty sure it's going to be the same. If it's different, I'll let you know. Otherwise, we'll jump back into chapter 13 or 14. And I'll see what I can do different, but I don't think I can get Linda or Maddie swallowed. There doesn't seem to be an option for that. You either get Sam swallowed, or you get Stan swallowed. Because of the way I did my circumstances, I don't think you can do it any other way. At least I think not. And this time, the screen's actually lit up. <laughs> That's terrifying to see everything so dark as it was. Man, uh, let's confront Stan again. Now you hold on a goddamn second. What the fuck? Get off me! Do you understand what you've done here? Do you have any idea? Who cares what she does with this shitty little B-movie? Just let it go, old man. You're a joke! And here's the punchline. Let's fail the punch. And you're a coward. I could just beat the shit out of you now, you know? I'm not gonna stoop to your level. <laughs> He's like, nope, I'm not gonna mess with you. Am I? <laughs> you! You lied to me! I did no such thing. Like hell you didn't! You promised me! It is no fault of mine if you misinterpreted what I promised you. My mom just died! You knew I was grieving, and you took advantage of me! A traveler is only as strong as its vessel. You got a hell of a lot to answer for, and a lot of hell to pay! to press the square. Hold on, I'm gonna try something. Because John this says let Mindy, Manny or Linda get swallowed. What if that's how I let them get swallowed? Uh, back away. I, I think this worked. I, I think this worked. I think this is the first time Linda's been swallowed, hasn't she? Linda! What is that? Stone. 
Excellent. We gotta run. Now! I wasn't really sure we could do that. I'm glad I took the risk there. Thank you, Jonathan. Doesn't absorb anyone else though. Does it just seem like one person to serve as like the base of his body? Kind of sad that you can't do anything to save Stan. Him and Bobby, you know, they they both kind of just. to immediately head here. And according to our notes, uh, let's see. Fail the generator and fail the QTs. Okay, yeah, we're good at failing. Uh, let's go ahead and turn this up to sacrifice. It's easier to fail with sacrifice. It'll happen faster. I do think I'm gonna put a cut here after she dies though and we hit the end game. But I'm not gonna restart it. I'm gonna let it play out. And the reason I'm gonna let it play out is to make sure we get into our oh, look how small the thing is on the hardest difficulty. I wanna let it play out to make sure it hits the cutting room floor. If I restart too early, it may not save the choice. brutal yeesh okay yeah I think I'm gonna put a I'm gonna put a stop here once again I'll let it play out in the background 
or I'll let it play out on my end just to make sure everything saves properly. So let's pick it up with uh, us punching Stan in the face. Sorry, Stan. You broke my nose, you fucking senile piece of shit! And one thing we do need to do, which I forgot, is we need to drop this to observer. Make sure we can do you, all the QTs that we need. You lied to me. I did no such thing. Like hell you didn't. You promised me. It is no fault of mine if you misinterpreted what I promised you. My mom just died. You knew I was grieving and you took advantage of me. A traveler is only as strong as its vessel. I don't think punching him has any effect. And a lot of hell to pay. Like, I don't think it has any effect. Help! Help me! Help! Help me get him! So here we have to let Stan get sacrificed. Did the voice was dead is awesome. Why was if you do nothing? You just back away by default. Well, that seemed violent. Like that seemed to happen a lot faster than it normally did. Let's go. So basically we need to do everything that we did the first time. Except Where don't go it? for the elevator. Maybe it's knocked out from the power cut? Shit! That's how we got down here. There has to be another way out. I'm on observer, right? Okay. Working. We could probably power the elevator. Let's try it. I don't want to fail this because then I got to redo everything again. This. You know what that looks like? I just realized that that's the that's the uh, the same thing that's in Man of Medan. The uh, the thing for the boat. Uh, yeah, it's the same exact tool.
almost perfect. Like, I had the white probably, what, like 50% of the time? Do you think that fixed the elevator? I guess we're gonna find out. I still can't believe going for the elevator caused you to die. I thought it would kill Maddie, and then you would escape. I love how the game can, uh, can continually surprise me. I mean, the last time we tried to save someone from Frank Stone, we ended up getting killed. Stay away from her, you son of a bitch! Stan just save our life? Go. All distracted. What? I'll just wait, what? Shit, shit, shit. No. Oh, Linda. I don't think distracting is a really good idea. Wait, she's back here. Is she gonna go through the time portal? How the fuck did I ever end up here? The very good question, Mega Man. Madison, I'm so glad we're finally able to talk one on one. Augustine. The fuck are you? What have you done? Ah, uh, yes. A regrettably unavoidable series of misfortunes. I've never seen this before. I don't expect you to understand everything at play here, but suffice it to say, one cannot make a proverbial omelet without breaking the proverbial eggs. Eggs? We're not fucking eggs. You you lied. You cheated, manipulated, and, and now there's some kind of horrible monster hunting us. I have never lied to you. Oh, give me a fucking break, lady. I can make your nightmares go away. I will make them go away. All this pain, all this trauma, gone. You just need to tell me you want me to. <laughs> go after yourself, or I do. Um. So I was advised to, I guess, be nice to her and to accept the deal. I mean, it's not the ruthless playthrough, but it is a failure playthrough. I mean, it's kind of a little bit of both, so... Yeah. I do want to go back here and say this. Although, maybe we say this on our redemption run. Oh! Oh, I don't know. I don't know! For now, I guess I do. I... Uh, I... I do... I can't live like this anymore. I I can't live in this nightmare. Perhaps it is time for something new. Is that joining Augustine was the only way to escape? Does that mean she's Frank Stone is just gonna kill us? Oh. oh okay, 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 okay. We gotta We gotta pass the chase. So be ready, Flatless. We've done this once before. You just can't mess up. I think if, I think you had like two chances. Come on, you can do this. Don't panic. Just just don't panic. Just breathe. All right. Ooh. I think I need to go out this door too. Unlike last time. It's hot on our heels. What the? Try to help.
Oh, we're Sam now? I, th this is awesome. Like, totally new stuff. Oh, and he's got his gun. Well, he had his gun. Oh, that, that looked painful. Oh! I can't wait for a redemption run. It's gonna be insane. It's gonna lose a leg. Man! Frank really does not like Sam's arm. You ain't shit, Stone. Never were. That was like a Dexter Morgan kill there. So there's another way Sam can die. How about that? What is that? I have no idea what causes it, but inescapable fate but linda and sam can't you help them nothing else can be done they must find their own path aren't you coming yes such a bad idea this is such a bad idea such a bad idea Yes. I... I just want this nightmare to end. And it will. Follow. This reminds me of the, uh... The, se the, the, the secret hidden ending in The Devil in Me. That didn't turn out too well for us, though. I have a feeling this isn't either! Pretty sure you already killed him, Frank. I mean, we never saw the knife pierce his stomach. Frank Stone is finally the man he was meant to be. My champion. A killer worthy of the entity. The bleed between worlds is open, split apart by sacrifice and violence. All will be swallowed by the entity's power. And what of me? The one who served up this world for it to devour. I'll oblige as its faithful servant, existing only to drink in its knowledge, share in its glory. I am Augustine Lieber, and I have brought the entity to your world. Indian, Indian and Jones last crusade thing right here. You have chosen poorly. Look away. This is a sacrifice. It is necessary and it is important. And like all the others made tonight, it demands your respect.
Every good story needs an ending, Sam Green. And ours has been long overdue. Oh. Now what they say about horror movies, until you see a body, they're not actually dead. <laughs> no light the bottom of a river that has no bed it is the truth that few will ever see and none will ever admit oh. may your dreams be ever sweet i was in between many is sacrificed to her yeah we all saw that coming i bear to you the offerings Does I she still get it await my reward for loyal service Unending. Yep. She does. So I wonder if two of the hooks come out now. Amazing, she survived. Oh, not anymore. And with that, a true ruthless failure ending. Everyone died. The first time we got Sam dead too, and everyone else was dead. Although the thing didn't come out for Maddie, she's still there lying on the floor. Well, man, I'm a little disappointed by that. Also, in previous playthroughs, uh, sometimes uh, that big thing in the sky had, like, this white cloud to it. They must have fixed that. Whether killing or surviving, the entity will play with our souls for all eternity. An endless hunt of fear and hope, pain and sacrifice from which even death is no escape. And now, let the trial begin. I'm just so excited we finally got everyone dead. All right, well, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and skip through the cuts and we'll be back up at the cutting room floor. We'll talk about it and then we will stop. Uh, Jonathan did mention some other playthroughs, but before we do another playthrough, of uh, maybe a ruthless run or whatever, uh, I do want to know if there's anything else that maybe we can see before like chapter two. Because I think the drink and the pendant are both important. So I want to go back and have Madison drink chapter 2. And then have her get the pendant in chapter 2. Uh, maybe we keep Chris in the future. Uh, yeah, I, I need to know what we can do differently in an extra playthrough. 
Let's look at the cutting room ploy here. Sand Punch does not seem to have an effect on this story overall. Or at least not that I can tell at this moment. So, Stan consumed, Chris consumed, Sam consumed. Sorry, Stan, Chris, and Sam, and Linda. There seems to be one other option. Who could that option be? Linda, Sam, Chris, and Stan. Who, who else would that be? I have no idea. And also, there's another option here before Sam is consumed and before Linda is consumed. And I think that's uh, the gunshot. What the heck is this one here? Is it possible to get Augustine consumed? Question mark? Hmm. Then we have the hunted section, which I might have been able to jump to instead of playing from like the start. But, you know, it's all right. So Linda fixed the generator. There's a 10% here. Maybe that's with Chris in your party. And then Maddie killed. That is a 0%. Oops. What did I just do? I had the tutorial button. I, 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 I'm trying to zoom in. And you can't zoom in. Which is very frustrating. If anyone from Supermassive is listening to me. Have a zoom in button. So that way I can see things more closely. Uh, I would really appreciate that. Uh, but anyway. Uh, where were we? So, Chris being consumed is a 2%. Then we had the hunted. Fix the generator. Uh, Maddie B killed here. That is a 0%. Uh, there's also 1% that I haven't seen. There's another 0% on the other side we haven't seen. And then there's another 1% where Linda was killed and Maddie escaped. And we saw that. Um, yeah, Linda escaped. Both escaped. Linda killed Maddie escaped. And Linda killed and Maddie escaped. And then Maddie accepted the proposal. 4%. Then there's a 2% here. I guess that's if you refuse the proposal. But I guess... Uh, yeah, that, that's kind of weird how that's a lower percentage than that one. 28% uh, Linda escape. 18% Maddie escapes. 1% Linda killed in this spot. Huh. It has a 2% here. I wonder how you get that 2%. Uh, Sam being captured. He was not killed after all. That was a 3%. Then there's this whole line here somehow, some way. I, I don't know what in the world you need to do to get here, but that looks really interesting. Uh, Sam used a machine or did not use a machine. So there is a possibility where he doesn't. We just saw that. Scroll up, 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 up. Okay, we did not hit that 6%. I don't know how to hit that 6% either. So you have the altar. Sam was sacrificed 3%. Maddie sacrificed 7%. 89% Augustine betrayed. But there's a 1% chance there. That may be Chris being sacrificed. Maybe. Like there's some things I have no idea how you get. And then there's some that I like theorize on. Okay. So Maddie escaping. We saw that in the previous one. Then we have the woods. And our current path was this 2% where Maddie survived. No, wait, that was, that was something else. Yeah, that was one of our last playthroughs. That doesn't make any sense. There's nothing else checked off here. Oh, nobody escapes. We kept going down this path. So, this path here in the woods, these are all other people surviving, probably. Hmm. <laughs> you know, this may be a redemption run thing. Where we do a redemption run, we get all the people. And then, after doing the redemption run, we do a... Sort of a negative redemption run. Where we go into a redemption run, we sort of, like, screw it all up. So, that way, we see all the different deaths here. And then, of course, the figure emerges. 
All right, my friends. Well, my name is Afl Isbert. This is your story based gaming channel and our continued let's play the Castillo Frank Stone from the World of Dead by Daylight. If you have any suggestions on something you want me to do before we restart uh, with a different path, let me know. Uh, there, there's a lot of variation here. And once we start in the redemption run, we can't go back to our ruthless failure run. So we need to do one completely first and then one completely second. Because if we do them out of order, it's going to be really hard to go back. Let me know what your thoughts are. I would appreciate that. I thank you so very much for being here. Much love to you all. I hope you have a wonderful, fantastic, amazing, awesome day. And until next time, so long. And take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember that you matter and you are brilliant and you are loved and you should always be true to yourself. Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.